Forgive an old woman, but I forgot your name. What was it again? Would you mind getting my book from the sleeping quarters? It would spare my bones the trip. It's called Great Voyages. Thank you very much. I've read this old book many times. Seems I find something new each read. And no matter how many times I've read it, it never fails to get me excited for adventure. Are you the adventuring type? Ah, after my own heart. I've had a lifetime of it, believe it or not. If you're sticking around in East Shade, Maybe I'll tell you all about it sometime. Captain Elona told me we'll be landing in Lindo shortly. I think we're all antsy to arrive. I've never been to East Shade. I've heard wonderful things about it. Did you know that the people there used to cover their mouths with garments? I've heard that since gone out of style. Quite a strange fashion fad if you ask me. As long as East Shade doesn't rock like this ship, I will love it. It's the quaint little seaside town we'll be landing in. It's one of the many gems of the country I hear. <sighs> Almost there. Ooh, that did not sound good.
You've woken. Do you remember what happened? I'm glad your memory's intact. You washed up on this beach just a short while after the ship sank. One doesn't last long in water this cold. From what I've heard, you were the only passenger misplaced during the wreck. The others are safe in town. East Shade, of course. Specifically, my home. I usually don't take visitors. But in this case, I can hardly blame you for floating in unannounced. Only your reason. Don't forget to take it when you leave. Even the frigid tide couldn't bring you to part from it. It must mean a great deal to you. I was about to head into town to share news of your survival. You should go there and let them know yourself. It's just up the path. On your way, though. I was about to head into town to share news of your survival. You should go there and let them know yourself. It's just up the path. On your way, though. It's you! You're on the ship! What happened to you? Oh, thank goodness! We thought you were lost. Oh, what a horrible experience! I'm so glad to see you're safe. What brought you to Eastshade, anyway? Very adventurous of you. I came to visit my family. You look like you could use a nice cup of tea. This flavor is a bit strong for some people, but the effects can be lifted with a sip of water from your water skin. Our captain is in a terrible state. I suppose that's to be expected. Mm, she won't even leave the dock. Perhaps it would console her to know that we all survived. 
you should speak with her. My family lives here in Lindo, so I'll be staying with them. If you find that night is coming and you're in need of a place to stay, you should check the inn. You'll be comfortable there. It gets cold around here at night. You shouldn't be out without a proper coat. Are you an artist? So am I! Do you want to see what I made? Look! It took all day. But I want to make my next one even better. What should I do? But I don't know how to make a canvas. All right! You're a nice artist after all. I know where some boards are. Follow me. Did you see when it ran a reef? I've never seen anything like that. Terrible waste of a good ship. And it went down so quickly. It's amazing anyone made it out of that. Now we just need the fabric. I don't know where to find that. Maybe we should ask someone. So we have everything we need now, right? We can make a canvas from this stuff? a real artist.
of stuff, right? So you've survived too. That means only one of us has been lost at sea. Who? Only the most important one of us all, Annabelle! Doesn't sound... I see. She carries you across the oceans and you don't even learn her name. Annabelle! My ship! My wooden, sea-loving daughter! <sighs> Killed by the damned reefs when we came into this miserable town. Kind of you to say so, but kindness does nothing to bring sweet Annabelle back to me. I'll be spending the rest of my days mourning Annabelle, sitting here, dreaming of a world where she wasn't destroyed and people actually remember her name. Off with you. Trade your life for hers. Now leave me be. Watch your step there. Lots of moving boxes around here. You looking a little waterlogged. Guessing you just came in off of that ship. I think you even got some seaweed hanging from your ear. Yeah, we all have those days, right? I mean, uh, my dad got in a shipwreck once. He wasn't as lucky as you, though. <laughs> Oh, no, he's, he's, he's fine. Just lost his leg is all. Now he gets to order us around even more. So, you'll probably be exploring all over, right? Would you do me a huge favor? My brother loves raspberry-filled pastries. Loves them. He can't get enough, but raspberries don't grow here. So, he puts in an overseas order every two weeks. It's crazy, really. Now, the thing he hates is grape-filled pastries. I, I mean, we all hate them, obviously, but he hates them even more. He'd destroy them all if he could, you know? He once saw an old lady eating some, and he grabbed the box and threw it in the ocean. It was the craziest thing. Okay, so what I did was fill his raspberry pastry bag with, uh, <laughs> grape pastries. Can you imagine what he's gonna do when he eats one? <laughs> He'll go insane! <laughs> 
He's always suspicious of me doing something like this, though, so it would be perfect if you could play along and act like you're a uh, delivery person. So, what do you say? You deliver them to him? Perfect! You gotta play the part, though. Really make them think they're raspberry pastries. <laughs> This'll be great. Here, take these. My brother lives over in Nava, so I'll meet you there in a few days, eh? I'll probably be near the bakery. You just come find me, and I'll point my brother out to you. From there. I can't fly if I don't even try! Everybody, turn around! If you don't all turn right now, I'm gonna jump! Still feeling moody? Wow, thanks! I'm going to be a moody artist like you when I grow up. Thanks again for the canvas! A newcomer. In the future, if you're ever in need of carriage to Nava, I'm your driver. My ox is strong, no?
Trying to get across the bridge, I guess. I hope you've got the glowstones for it. It's not free, you know. The rule is you pay once and you can use it as much as you'd like. From other people, I think. It seems to me that you're in need of some money. What's all that you're carrying? Looks heavy. Are you some kind of painter? Hmm. You know what? Maybe there's a way you can get the ghost stones out of me after all. There's a gazebo in Lindau. Real pretty spot. Maybe you've been there. Anyway, I'd like a painting of that view. The gazebo is easy to find. It's just behind the inn. And I want the painting from the gazebo, not of the gazebo. It's the view, not the building, if you get my meaning. Gum fish unfighting today. Great viewpoint, isn't it? You must be the traveler from the wrecked ship. Oh, good. Ingolf needs some visitors every now and then. I wish he would spend more time in town, but he'd rather be alone. Yes, I run the inn. I always keep a full stock of soup and tea to refresh weary travelers. When I was young, I traveled all over this island. I'd love to adventure again one day. Look, the eclipse is starting.
Not a bad show, right? I try to come up here every day. I guess it just doesn't get old for me. Anyway, if you haven't got lodging for the night, feel free to stay at the inn. I'll leave the upstairs room unlocked for you. Drop in at your leisure. Don't worry about payment. Shipwreck survivors stay free of charge. Take care now. Ah, the traveling artist. I think the dock workers used fabric sacks with the incoming and outgoing shipments. You might ask one of them. Take care now. Who's there? Nika? Is that you? Well, I can tell by your voice that you're not Nika. You're being smart with me. You must be one of the tourists. Terrible about the sinking and all that. Glad you're okay. Yada, yada, etc. Uh, but will you go get Nika, the innkeeper? I need help. Brilliant! I'll wait here. Ugh. You look well. Oh, of course he does. And what is it this time? Again? That's like the eighth time. All right, then, we'd better go help. Oh, it's really stuck, isn't it? Yeah, it's pretty stuck. I think what we need here is some soap. Would you be a dear and fetch some soap from Amin's house? It's just down the stairs and across the courtyard. Is he... 
a friend of yours? Ah, well, I shouldn't gossip then. Right, well, here's some soap. Safe travels. Well, let's try this thing then. Here, let me have that soap. Well, I guess it was convenient that you dropped in when you did. Thanks for getting Nika. Well, you are a nosy tourist, aren't you? Beeswax! My garden is filled with all sorts of wriggly critters. I think the dock workers used fabric sacks with the incoming and outgoing shipments. You might ask one of them. I lived there for a few years, working as a baker. I do miss the bustle of the city sometimes. It's a bit more calm than Nava. I think it's quite a nice place to relax. Certainly. I feel so adventurous staying here in Lindo. I live in Nava, but sometimes I just long for the primitive lifestyle Lindo offers. This is my first excursion out of Nava. It just feels like the right time for a dramatic adventure. Some may find the story of my journey utterly inspiring, Nothing could have prepared me for the muddy paths, the unbearable heat. I even had to eat outside. Overall, it was a dreadful experience, but I braved through it all. Yes, it certainly was impressive on my part. I so dearly wish my friends could see how adventurous I've become.
I saw you talking with the captain. How is she doing? I don't think I've heard her talk about much else. Hmm, I wonder if she'll ever recover. How have you been? His disappearance was all very mysterious. I don't believe anyone's seen him in a long time. I think the dock workers use fabric sacks with the incoming and outgoing shipments. You might ask one of them. be such a great prank! Uh, don't forget to meet me in Nava. I'm usually near the bakery. gone and painted the gazebo view. Are you willing to sell it? Well, how about that? Got myself something fancy. See you around. Thanks again for that painting. Damn fish aren't biting today.
I stay busy working this dock. It's hard, but fulfilling for me. We've had quite a few shipwrecks here. There's a reef surrounding the bay and that's what does it. It shouldn't slow down traffic too much though. I'm just glad you all made it. I work on the docks almost every day. If you ever have any questions about Lindau, come on over and I'll do my best to help. Fabric. We go through loads of it. Here, these lengths are defective for shipping, but will perhaps serve your purposes. Lindau is a nice port town, although we don't have much to export anymore, aside from bloom sacks. Now most of our tourism these days are just people passing through, on the way in or on the way out of Nava. The salty sea air never gets old. Take care now.